blush. I mean, wow, this blush is rupees 200. Let me just tell you that. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I hope you guys are doing good today. So this is actually my favorite, favorite video to film. I have actually a bunch of new makeup to test out. Like these are all affordable makeup. Like this box is full of all new makeup that I actually haven't tried out and I'm going to try out this in today's video. Also, not only makeup, I do have a brush set as well. This is a very new brush set that I got from Amazon. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing in today's video. I'm super excited and pumped to film this video. So let's get started. Also, if you are someone who's new to this channel, thank you so much for watching this video. I post affordable makeup and skincare related videos on this channel here. So you can hit the subscribe button and also the notification bell because that way you can, you know, get notified whenever I post a new video. So without further ado, let's get started. So starting off, I am actually going to test out this Mars primer. Now this is actually a Chloe primer. This is a very recent launch from Mars Cosmetics and you guys know I really love Mars Cosmetics. And I really wanted to test this one out and actually this one, uh, they sent it to me. Uh, so yeah, I got two shades. They have two shades and they did send two shades. So I'll swatch this for you guys and yeah, I'll put this on my face right now. So the shade, this is the shade Moon Glow 01. I did swatch everything earlier. So yeah, I did open it up and swatch it. So this is actually 02 Light Beam. So I think 02 is like a little bit golden. And 01 is, I feel like it's a little, you know, on the silver side. 01 is actually a little bit more, uh, has a pink kind of a reflect to it. And 01 is light. I don't think so you can see this uh, up front nicely but yeah this feels like a max strobe cream i used to use the max strobe cream like back in the day i had a very sample size product from the mac uh, strobe cream so this actually feels like that very lotion like and it has a little bit of like chloe kind of a thing to it so i think i'll put i'll go in with the shade 01 because i feel like this one will suit my skin tone much more better now let's just do one pump first I hope this doesn't look too glowy. Yeah, it's a, it's a little, little too glowy maybe. apply a little bit more than I should have because obviously I'm looking like straight up tin man foil uh, my skin is looking very foil type of a glowy look as you can see so I think so half a pump would do with this product and this is not that moisturizing it's not drying also it's like somewhere right in between but it's glowy you know it's not hydrating or anything of that sort but it's glowy it's definitely uh, like totally goes with the name take a glow primer it is very glowy and if you want something glowy for your base I just think that this is going to be a good choice so the next product I got is this e.l.f. Uh, this is the e.l.f. Flawless Satin Foundation. Now I really wanted to get this e.l.f. foundation for a really long time. And I got this because this was on 20% off and I really wanted to try this one out because I know I have seen people talk about how beautiful the finish is and everything. So I really wanted to try it out by myself. So I got this and I got the shade, um, I got the shade Neutral. With it, this has neutral undertones this is the shade sand now i feel like it's going to suit my skin maybe it can be a little bit i don't know it looks a little darker than my skin tone we'll have to see how this looks like uh so i'm just going to take one pump of this and put this all over my face and blend it with a beauty blender So as you can see that in the bottle, this foundation definitely looks a little bit darker than my skin tone. But on my skin, when I was blending this out, this actually looked very pale. 
and it's one or two shades lighter than my skin tone so i just don't know what to say i mean i don't like to apply foundation that is lighter than my skin tone but i just i don't have any other option so i will be applying a concealer now as for concealer i'm just going to apply my old maybelline concealer because i don't have a new concealer to try out So next actually I'm going to apply a bronzer and I'm going to apply with these brushes. I'm going to use these brushes. Now this brush is actually from BH Cosmetics, this whole brush set. And this one retails for I think 600. I got all of these brushes. Now this one I would use for a bronzer. This one I would use for a blush. And this one I would use also for a blush I think so. And this one is a highlighter brush which looks pretty good. And this one is like a just a foundation brush which I wouldn't honestly use for foundation and these are some eye brushes that they have so I'm going to use all these brushes today maybe not all but like just to do my blush and bronzer and eyeshadow I'm going to use these brushes now BH Cosmetics this is actually a authentic BH Cosmetics brush set I know that because I have already tried out BH Cosmetics brushes and I know that this is actually authentic so I'm going to use this one for my bronzer today I don't have a new bronzer to try out so I'm just going to use my old bronzer you know on my skin so I'm going to use the Nykaa uh, compact this is the 08 shade and I really love to bronze up with this one so I'm going to use this as my bronzer today. You can see that this just gives a very light type of a bronzer. These brushes are very very soft. It's blending the bronzer really really well into my skin. And it's really nice size also because it definitely has diffused the product so well into my skin. So after the bronzer is done, now I'm going to go move in with the cream blush. I got this blush from this small store on Instagram and they are selling these blushes only for 200 rupees. I will leave all the Instagram info down below. And I have tried this blush like out twice and I love, love, love the formulation. I cannot believe that they this retail for only 200 rupees and i'm definitely going to get more shades and it's always so good to support like small instagram businesses small businesses and honestly it's really good especially if you have dry skin and you like that glowy type of a blush you're going to love this now i got the shade tinted mocha and you can see this shade is very unique i don't have a shade like this in my collection actually this has a little bit of that mauvey tone to it but it's it looks warm on my skin too like let me just show you how this looks on the skin so i'm just going to use this blush brush from bh cosmetics can you see how that instantly made my skin look very glowy like this has pigment to it this is glowy and if you want that very dewy skin for summer and if you are someone who just uses bb cream and you just want to go out that door looking like a very dewy person hydrated person you're just going to love this blush i mean wow this blush is rupees 200 let me just tell you that wow i'm just so impressed can you see like this one honestly looks a uh, very how do i say very warm on me but on the pan it's very it has that uh how would i say it has a little bit of that morph undertone and on my cheeks it just looks very good i mean honestly i love this shade so much i love the formulation so much and i just think that this is one of the best blushes i have tried to be very honest one of the best cream blushes i have tried and this looks good without any makeup as well so the next product i have is actually a miss claire strobing powder now i do have to say that my skin already looks very very dewy and i don't want to overdo it by applying a highlighter and i have swatched this highlighter this honestly has some glow to it so i don't want to look too much glowy in today's video so maybe i'll use this in some later video maybe you know i love doing all of these uh, affordable makeup videos try on hauls so maybe i'll use this later someday at time but for today's video i'm just going to skip this but yeah i got this from nika and this one retails for i think so i got this for around 395 rupees yeah so for 400 i got this 
uh, Miss Claire strobing powder. So I don't have anything obviously for my brows so I'm just going to do my brows real quick and I'm going to come back for my eyeshadow. So as for eyeshadow, I do have this beautiful palette right here. This is from Kiss Beauty and I have to say this palette is so beautiful. Now this shades, can you just take a look at these shades? Wow, like these two here are blushes actually and all of these are eyeshadows. Now I can use this obviously as eyeshadows too. And since I've already applied a blush, I'm not going to use this as a blush. I'm going to use this as eyeshadow only. And yeah, if you want something that has a blush and eyeshadows in it, then I just think that this is such a cute little palette. Now I'm going to first use obviously a transition shade here. So I feel like I'm going to take this peach shade right here and put this all over my eyes. Now I'm going to take a slanted brush that I got from BH Cosmetics brush set. Wow. Yeah, so that I got from BH Cosmetics brush set. So I'm not going to use this slanted brush because it's a little bit difficult. I'm going to use this brush again from the set as well. So I just applied two shades on my eyes. Now I'm going to apply this in color expose. This is a eyeshadow but this is like Colourpop eyeshadow type of a thing where it's very squishy and it's very like a metallic type of eyeshadow and I really wanted to test this one out. This only retails for 195 rupees and I really wanted to test this one out because it's so affordable obviously and I just wanted to see if this actually feels like the Colourpop eyeshadows. So I am just going to take this with my fingers right here and it definitely feels very very squishy. So I'm just going to take on my hands and put this on the inner parts. This honestly has a very beautiful beautiful sheen to it. I don't know if you can see but it's like a very beautiful glowy type of eyeshadow and honestly I am someone I don't like shimmer shadows that much if you have been seeing my videos you would know but this one honestly looks pretty great so I'm just going to apply on this eye as well so this is how it looks like you can see if I tilt my head you can see that there is the shine to it and it just is very very beautiful Wow, using it. Now I'm going to take this Rimmel. This is a liner that I have talked about in like last video. And I said that I'm going to use this in a video. So I'm going to use it in today's video. Taking this brush from the set. So my eyes are done now and I'm going to use this lip liner that I got. This is the In Color Intense Lip Liner and it's in the shade Silky Brown. This is a very brown tone type of a nude. So I'm going to use this for my lips now. So this is how the shade looks like. Now I have two lipsticks to try out. I have this in Inside lipstick and I don't remember the shade name actually. Uh, the shade name is Joyful and you can see this is a beautiful beautiful brown toned lipstick. And I also have this Blue Heaven lipstick and it's definitely a very beautiful peachy toned lipstick now i don't know which one to use honestly i want to use both but maybe i'll keep this for future videos i will like obviously swatch and show you guys how the shade is but i think i'm going to go in with the blue heaven and this one only retails for 85 rupees
so this is how my makeup turned out i honestly really love when all of the products just work so well so let's just start with the first the primer i really like the primer a lot i just think that just half a pump would do honestly and you can go for the 01 shade if you have a very you know medium skin tone and you can go for the 02 shade if you have a lighter skin tone i just think that this feels like the max strobe cream dupe i finished up my max strobe cream dupe so i just cannot compare it side by side but i feel like it's almost the same type of a product so now coming on to the foundation i just feel like the foundation was so good medium coverage decent like it has good decent amount of coverage it looks flawless on the skin it has a little bit of that satin dewy type of a finish which is one of my like favorite foundations type of foundations but the only thing is that that this honestly looked a little how do i say it? a little light on my skin tone i mean i would definitely would have preferred if this was one or two shades darker but i i just don't know i'll just make it work maybe just mixing a little bit of dark type of uh foundation in this maybe this would work so yeah i really did like the foundation a lot as well now coming on to the blush one of my favorite cream blushes i do have to say that you guys if you like creamy dewy blush you have to get it you can see how beautiful this looks on my skin like I honestly am in love with this formulation. The shade, everything, it's perfect and it, as I said, it's always really good to support small businesses and when they make this kind of amazing product, I feel like supporting it much much more. So I really did like this formulation and the blush as well. So the next was the eyeshadow palette. Now honestly, I do have to say I did like the eyeshadow palette a lot. It was very creamy, blendable. Uh the shimmer shades I feel like aren't going to be that creamy because honestly, when I swatched this the early day this was kind of a very stiff type of a formulation the shimmers so i just think that the mattes are honestly really really good and if you want like these types of blushes in your collection you can use this as blushes too obviously it's going to be a little on the pigmented side but you can use this as an eyeshadow and i think that for 200 and something rupees i think i paid like 240 rupees for this really really amazing i love peachy tones you guys know that i love warm tones and i really did like this a lot so the next product I tried out is obviously the ColourPop. I feel like this is like exactly like the ColourPop eyeshadows. So creamy, so amazing, like just full of pigment and it just is looks gives that glossy type of an effect on the eyes and I just cannot imagine that this retails for 195 rupees. I just think that you all definitely should get this if you like shimmer shadows and if you like that glossy kind of a vibe. I I am personally going to order two more shades of this, you know, uh, eyeshadow. Definitely ordering more from this. So for the next is the lip liner. I did think that color is beautiful. If you have darker skin tone, you're still going to love this. And yeah, if you're searching for a good brown lip liner, I think so. This is a really good option. Now, I haven't tried the inside lip, uh, this shade but i really did like how this shade is looking and i am definitely excited to try this out in the future as well so now the blue heaven lipstick i feel like this lipstick shade is just so beautiful so pretty if you have dusky skin you're still going to love this just use a darker shade of lip liner and this one in the center wow and honestly the formulation is not like straight up too much pigmentation you just have to swipe like twice to get the full-on pigment but it's very very comfortable on the lips definitely doesn't feel like an 85 of this lip like lipstick like this doesn't feel like that at all and yeah it's just very very creamy so that was it for today's video oh my god this video i think so like took me one and a half hours to film I know that you guys love seeing affordable makeup on this channel. I'm going to bring much more of these affordable type of videos and I know I honestly love testing out these affordable makeup and I just love, you know, collecting makeup. I am a makeup holder and, you know, I just love to test out these products so much this is one of my favorite videos to film so anyway thank you so much for watching i will see you guys in my next video also if you are someone who's new to this channel and if you haven't subscribed yet you can hit the subscribe button and also the notification bell as well and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye bye